up guys, welcome to CJ's Vlogs and welcome to another video. <laughs> okay, the downpipe, the classic, classic turbo modification, um, you know, it's something that most people do, whether you have a GTI, whether you have a 135i, 235i, M2, M4, you name it, um, you've probably, your downpipe has probably been your first mod, and, well, I've done it, and it's taken the car from sounding like this, Which wasn't too bad, like there's nothing wrong with the six cylinder uh, straight six turbo that comes out of BMW, but with the downpipe it makes it sound like this. But it's also a performance enhancer, although I haven't done any software, it's still, the car just revs faster, it burbles, it snaps, it crackles. shifts are insane like here's a tunnel isn't that <laughs> it's pretty it's pretty 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 good it's a mod that I have been recommended to by my friends for ever um, it's a mod they've done on their various hot hatches and sports coupes and so it's done so I'm gonna let you guys enjoy it and I'm also gonna enjoy it man this thing sounds insane and it revs so much faster there's there's like no I wouldn't say there's no lag I mean there's only really sophisticated supercars that have zero lag in their engines but I would say that it's significantly decreased the engine just revs so much faster and it's so excitable and the throttle response is also a huge huge factor now because you just get anywhere near that throttle and it almost feels like a naturally aspirated one <laughs> oh yeah it's good it's very very good Welcome to the BMW X3. This is our BMW X3. I actually haven't shot this car, which doesn't make sense because we've had a little while, you know, under the recommendation of the famous BMW YouTuber, should I say? No, I'm kidding. Uh, Joe Achilles. If you want to buy a BMW or if you're on the borderline, he is one to watch because <laughs> he just makes you love BMW. Among other cars, he gets to shoot Audis and stuff, but specifically when I started watching his channel it was BMW, which subsequently led me to buying my M235i, 
and to this X3 and there are more to come for sure um, but this is the X3 and it is a wonderful car I mean there's the things I can highlight about it is it's like a very sporty chassis for an SUV um, it's got enough power and it also balances that with good economy nice tech you know those are just the highlights I have to do a full review I think uh, because it is a very popular car it's actually one of the most highest selling luxury SUVs in the United States as well as South Africa and oddly enough this car is made in South Africa uh, what used to be the 3 series plant in Roslyn Pretoria which is like uh, about 80 kilometers north of where I live um, is now the BMW X3 plant the only thing they don't make there, the only variant they don't make there is the X3M um, that's made in Spartanburg in the United States um, but it's a beautiful thing I think we should actually try and get into that factory I've been there before but I think we should sort of shoot a video there to show you um, but we'll see and today we'll also be checking out some new Ferraris that came in you know South Africa has been in a lockdown for 50 days almost 60 days now um, due to the coronavirus pandemic that's affecting the entire world I managed to squeeze out some videos because I had footage before we had locked down our country um, but we're slowly reopening and I think I'm gonna bring, bring you guys some really cool content to come um, yeah so we've got about 20 Ferraris that have come into the harbor um, that are obviously being distributed between our three dealerships um, but a lot of cars coming to the dealership where I am uh, which is the head office for Ferrari in our country um, so they have some fantastic specs you know the, the specs I've shown you on the channel are pretty insane so far but there are so many so many wicked ones to come um, and ones that have come already um, so we'll be checking out those so let's go here we go here's our beautiful beautiful dealership um, and I'm already seen something special. Oh, that's an F12 TDF. Okay, so we're back here, and of course, we have to wear masks. It's a restriction. Um, there's going to be signs. We have to practice social distancing. And our regulation is that you have to wear a mask whenever you're out in public. So what are we looking at here? We are looking at a 48 pista, a very special one. A very close friend and customer of ours. Um, this car is so unique because it is Cana di Fucile with the Giallo Triplo Strato stripes and it's complemented with yellow everywhere. In terms of the interior, it's got yellow belts, yellow details. Actually, it is open. Yellow through the dashboard, the buttons, the counter. Incredible. Such a beautiful spec. It's so striking but so classy at the same time as well as the yellow dream lines on the engine bay how gorgeous is this car it's very special for him as well it's his first ferrari special edition one of many i think that he will own but it is so beautiful in the sunlight it is just incredible so congrats so we're also a bit i would say overweight with the cars at the moment uh, these have been sitting here because they were serviced pre-lockdown and some owners chose to leave them so we've got some gems in here and we are selling some gems so it's quite nice let's take this back down to storage <laughs> these cars don't mess around these details are absolutely beautiful wow what's also amazing is the carpet with the yellow stitching to match the interior incredible so this is really cool because you know the, the pista has got an aluminium floor um, and it's quite you know it's a special edition it's raw um, so what happens is it usually gets a bit noisy in here because of the floor because also the sound deafening is so so thin but also because um, you know your shoes and stuff make noise on the floor but uh, with the carpet it makes a huge difference and you can sort of use the car more frequently I would say um, 
And also, look, if you're taking a lovely lady for a drive, you or you put the carpets in and you sort it. You can remove them. Um, but that view, wow, that's a view of 720 horsepower. Beautiful. It's an area I don't show people often, so you're actually quite privileged to be here. This is the pizza, the grey one that we're in. Um, there's a white portofino that is one of the first pista spiders in the country. Uh, another portofino that is a GTC for Luso. Another pista coupe, we've got a GTC for Luso. This particular one is blue Tour de France with almost a white leather interior. Absolutely beautiful. And next to it is a red 812. Stunning, stunning cars, all waiting to go to the new owners. Thank you.